Hi everyone in grade 5 and welcome to English video lesson. Today we are going to study module 9 Our World Part 2. Let's start with our objectives. By the end of this video you will be able to identify the usage of adjective full infinitive plus object. Use the adjective full infinitive plus object in speaking and writing correctly. Dear students, all what you need is to open your student's book page 106, 107, and 133. Your workbook page 82. Make sure that you open the right pages. Dear students, do you remember yesterday's lesson? Great! We read about the eco-friendly gadgets, the wooden keyboard, the water power clock, and the green mobile phone. Let's start with the water power clock. Let's start with the water power clock. Dear students, are you ready here? To underline any examples of adjective followed by infinitive? Great! Here we go! It is also very easy to use. Can you tell me now what you note about the adjective easy in the text? Well, it's followed by to and the base form of the verb. Remember, dear students, the to and the base form of the verb is called full infinitive. So here, it's plus adjective plus full infinitive plus object. Here you can say, it's easy to use. It's easy to use the water power clock. Now, let's start here with the green mobile phone. Are you ready to underline any examples of adjectives followed by full infinitives? Okay, here we go. Great! Mobile phone is very easy to use. Also, we have here, it's not difficult to recharge it. Can you tell me now what you note about the adjectives easy and difficult in the text? Well, it's followed by to and the base form of the verb. Let me remind you here that to and the base form of the verb is called full infinitive. So here we can say it is easy to use. Also here, it is not difficult to recharge it. Dear students, remember, it's plus adjective plus full infinitive plus object. As we say here, it is not difficult to recharge it. Here is an object. Now, for further information, let's go to the back of the student's book, page 133. Let's have a look here. Look! This mobile phone is new. It's easy to use. I don't like this computer game. It's difficult to play. Here is an example using the full infinitive. It's easy to use. It's difficult to play. Here, it's plus an adjective plus full infinitive. 
Look here. What can you see here? Look at the granddad. He told his grandson. It's easy to send an email. So here it's plus adjective plus full infinitive plus object and email. It's easy to send an email. Let's play a guessing game and learn more about adjective plus full infinitive. First of all, look at the pictures. What are they saying? Here, look at your face. We have sad face. Then look at this boy. This computer game is easy to play or this computer game is difficult to play. If we look at the boy and his face, we have to say, great, this computer game is difficult to play. Let's play another guessing game and learn more about adjective full infinitive. Look at the picture. We have happy face. Then look at this girl. Yes, it's boring to learn Chinese or it's fun to learn Chinese. When we look at this girl, we can say it's fun to learn Chinese. Good job. Dear students, you are going to listen to a dialogue between two children, and you have to take right beside the correct picture, according to what you hear. Let's go. 5. Listen and tick the correct picture. This is for you, Bobby. A present for me? Yes. Open it. Wow! A new tablet. Thanks. You're the best sister. You're welcome. I know you wanted it. And what's that? It looks strange. Let me show you. You use it to recharge the tablet on a sunny day. You see, you can use power from the sun to recharge its battery. It's really eco-friendly. Oh, Penny, you always want to protect the environment. Yeah, that's me. The bad thing is that it's plastic, but we can't do anything about that. Yes, that's true, but a wooden tablet that uses power from the sun. Hmm, that's a nice idea. Yeah, it is. Are you ready to take right beside the correct picture? Okay, great. Which picture? Good job. C is the right picture. Let's practice more. Can you make similar sentences? Here we go. It's easy to ride a bike. Here, we have already used easy and full infinitive to ride a bike. It's fun to play basketball. We use fun an adjective and full infinitive to play basketball. Now, this time for you. You can say it's difficult to learn Chinese. It's boring to watch TV. It's dangerous to go scuba diving. It's exciting to play computer games. Open your workbook, page 93. Read and write, then match. Let's do number one as a model. It's easy 
to bake a cake. Let's match E with number one. It's easy to bake a cake. Now pause the video and write your sentences, then match. We're back. Let's check your answer. It's difficult to learn Arabic. Great! It's difficult to learn Arabic. Number three. It's fun to visit the amusement park. It's exciting to go sailing. It's important to recycle. Now, use the ideas in the box and write what you think as in the example. Mobile phones are easy to use. Recycling is important to keep our planet safe. It's easy to use the Internet. It's difficult to learn Spanish. It's fun to play computer games. Let's check what have we done today. We have identified the usage of adjective, full infinitive, plus object. Also, we have used the, the adjective, full infinitive, plus object in speaking and writing correctly. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.